When Skype first launched about four and a half years ago, it revolutionized the way that people talk and enabled billions of minutes of conversation, bringing people around the world closer together. Over the last four and a half years, the way that people communicate has evolved, and Skype has evolved right along with them. We felt it was time to really take the next major step forward in releasing Skype 4.0. What you should look for is integrated communications, where we've brought forward the opportunity to bring all of these uh, capabilities together into one conversation with people. With Skype 4.0, we've really, really focused on making it simple to use. We've looked at the user experience from the time someone hit Skype.com right the way through to making their first call, and every aspect of that we're focusing on making it incredibly simple. Working with Skype certified hardware in the new version of Skype 4.0 is a breeze. All you need to do is take the device you have, whether it be a headset or a webcam, and plug it into your laptop. Finding friends in Skype 4.0 is really, really simple too. What we've done is we've included the ability to go and look at your existing online address books, so your um, webmail account, for example, and within a couple of minutes, you find the people you know and you're talking to them. Really quick, really easy. We also felt it was time for our user interface to evolve, simpler, cleaner, and more intuitive. As part of that new user interface, we've created a palette to really show off the incredible capabilities of video. The, the, the picture is larger right from the beginning. You can um, resize your own picture, move it anywhere around the screen. It, it really feels like you're in the room with that person, talking to them and sharing those experiences. We're very, very proud of it. It's far richer and far more engaging than anything that you've seen to date. This is the first beta release of Skype 4.0. We're releasing it to a limited set of users as a way to begin the conversation with our community. We'll listen closely to the feedback from our user and take that feedback as we evolve the product until we get to the final release that becomes the default download for Skype.com. So to our community of over 300 million users all around the world, thank you very much for your passion and please enjoy this new release of Skype 4.0.